Hi hey everybody, it's Faith from Fireside Center. I hope everyone is well. It's the 15th of August. Three readings left to do in the cycle. So, I'm going to plug away and do what I can do tonight. Hopefully I can get all three done. <laughs> I'm pretty tired, but we're going to do our best. Okay, the moon popped out. Pisces, it's time for your reading. What am I doing? I need to go out front. There we go. This reading will be for Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus for the month of August 2020. If it resonates with you, cool. It's your free will to do whatever you choose to do with the message given by the cards. If you choose to do anything at all, it is your journey, not mine. I just read the cards. If it does not resonate, that's okay too. You can check your Moon, Rising, or Venus sign readings if you think you might some want. La, 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 la. If you think you might want something that may resonate a little bit better. Keep in mind, time and energy are both fluid. All things can and maybe vice versa. Might even play out from the perspective of the cross-watcher. And cross-watchers, as always, are welcome here, too. So without further ado or delay. Pisces, we're going to get your cards at the table for August. Go over what's going on with you, what's going on with the person you're dealing with, the challenge, and what can be done. Why are you here, Pisces? Ten of Swords in the Upright. The worst of it's over. Sun's fixing to start shining again. Ending a painful cycle. All right. Closing a chapter, that, that's not a bad thing. It's really not. How do you feel about the person you're dealing with? Two, two of Cups reversed. Gee, who'd have thought that was going to come out? You feel disconnected. What do you think of them? Page of Wands in the reverse. Probably not a lot of communication going on right now of any kind or type. What do you want from them? Three of Swords. You just want this to be over. Okay. All right. How do they feel about you? Queen of Wands. They may still hold a little bit of a torch for you. Possibly. Or there's confrontational feelings there. We'll get a clarifier on it in a minute. Could be a little bit of both. What do they think of you? Ten of Pentacles. You're moving on up. You're getting it back together. You've collected yourself. You've been concentrating on work, possibly. What do they want from you? Six of Pentacles reversed. I'm definitely going to have to throw a clarifier on that. This could indicate that maybe things weren't equal. Maybe they want to tip the scales in a different way. What's the challenge here? Three of Pentacles reversed. There was just no foundation. It was crumbly. It wasn't stable or solid. What can be done? Two of Wands reversed. I don't see being stuck at the crossroads as an option. That's kind of strange. We'll get some clarity. Universe, Source, and Spirit. Can I get some clarity on the cards on the table for my Pisces friends for August 2020? Pisces, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, August Do we really need to know why the Two of Cups is here? I don't think so. I'm not going to clarify it. Page of Wands is interesting, though. Why is the Page of Wands reversed here? Hi. Six of Swords. There's no communication. There's... there's 
You think they've moved on already. Okay, fair enough. Why is the Three of Swords reversed here? Or what Pisces wants from the other person? King of Swords reverse pops out. Possibly they may want to know that you felt something. Or you might want to know that they felt something. Wow. That hurt. I mean, I felt that. I got nothing. I don't have anything else to say about that. Why is Queen of Wands up right here? Five of Wands. They still carry a torch for you. They don't want to fight with you. No. That's how they feel. What do they think of you? Ten of Pentacles. Why is Ten of Pentacles here? Page of Pentacles reversed comes out. Okay. Okay. That's interesting. Page of Wands reversed. Page of Pentacles reversed. <laughs> I just heard you're not giving anything up. Nope. There's been a disconnect. There's no apologies here. I don't even think there's harsh feelings. Why is the Six of Pentacles reversed here? Knight of Swords reversed in the Emperor. One more on that. Nine of Swords Reverse. They just want to put this out of their head. They want to get their stuff together. They don't want to talk about it. They don't want to deal with it. It's like, yeah, things weren't fair. Things weren't equal. But we need to push on, push through here. Wow. Okay. Well, I guess the worst of it's over. Why is the Three of Pentacles reversed here? The Fool comes out. One more. Unsteady foundations, uneven scales. Ace of Pentacles reversed. The Five of Cups upright and the Knight of Pentacles reversed. Okay. Things may have moved too quickly. Someone was still coming out of a state of sadness. Somebody wanted to put the brakes on a little bit. This was an unsteady foundation. It may just may not have been meant to be with this Ace of Pentacles reversed. It may just be that simple. This wasn't meant to be. Hmm. All right. Well, what can be done? Why is the Two of Wands reversed here? Knight of Cups. 
One more. Hi. One more. One more. Seven of Wands, Page of Swords. Seven of Wands upright, Page of Swords reverse. Remain, communication needs to remain cut off for at least a while. Need to get control back. Maybe go out and play the field a little bit. I need one more. I don't understand why this two of wands came out in the reverse. Because that's saying to stay at the crossroads. That's not saying to move forward or move on. Two of Swords reversed. Oh, that's it. The difficult decision needs to be made as to whether you hang on or you let go. Hmm, okay. Well, let's get some advice. It's going to be short. Nine of Swords reversed in the Devil. Uh, one more set on that, please. Six of Wands, Page of Cups. Don't go crazy over this. Don't allow this, don't allow the disconnect to be as obsessive and as toxic as the relationship potentially was. And I think you will end up coming out of this better than you were before and more able to take an honest cup or give an honest cup. I think this came in and it was meant to change you. The devil, it's not an all bad card. I mean, it it can represent a powerful life-changing connection. It doesn't always necessarily mean toxic. I mean, that's usually what it ends up meaning. It can also indicate a sexual connection. I, I hate dancing around that. I really do. But don't allow this to get any worse than it already is. You're through. You're through the end of it. I mean, it's over. You're through the worst part of it. And I, some people say, well, the worst part of it is picking up and dusting off. Yeah, you're probably right. You're probably right. It's the getting back up after you get knocked down that's the hard part. For some of us. But you'll get back up again. Four of Cups in the reverse, Four of Wands in the reverse. Queen of Pentacles upright, Temperance in the reverse. Don't. Don't ignore future cups and keep the doors closed. And allow all this negative energy left over from this connection to mess with you for very long. Because you could end up missing the catch. Don't let this become like a paralyzing fear thing. Know what I'm saying? Don't let that happen. I think in, a made, in some kind of weird way they might want you to not let go. They might want you to go a little bat poop bonkers. Don't. Because I see the Nine of Swords revert both came out over here. So. I don't know. This is crazy. Don't let this mess with you for too long. You're through the worst of it, Pisces. It's going to be okay. See what next month has to bring for you. But this is what this month has. I'm sorry it was so short, but. 
You know, when the energies for me are cut and dry, it's cut and dry. I mean, just so know that you love to be blessed. Thanks for stopping by. I'll catch you guys in a couple of weeks for your September reads before I go on vacation at the end of the month. Be blessed. Peace and love.